I'm in Dallas, Texas with Ellis Partners in Management Solutions kicking off a day of learning for a group of in-house trainers that work for companies that manage apartment communities. Today we are exploring how professional development and training can be more efficient, productive, engaging, and effective using flipped classroom strategies, shifting our instructional practices so that most of the training time is spent on active learning and only a small percentage of the training time is used for content delivery. During my presentation, I model a series of lessons allowing participants to not only learn about the flipped teaching method and ask questions, but also this lets them experience how these strategies work in a classroom with adult learners. For the first lesson, I play a short video that gives an overview of how efficient and concise recorded lectures can be compared to live presentations of the same information. This video is a minute and a half long, but would have taken nearly six minutes to present live. With the time saved, I challenge the participants to collaborate to create a paper slide video response and then reflect on their creation. Next, they experience an economics lesson about demand. This lecture is 13 minutes long and would have taken 45 to 60 minutes to deliver the same information live. After the video is over, participants go on a walk and talk to discuss how they would reteach the information from the lecture they just watched. When they return, they create, record, and reflect on their unique versions of the lesson. This experience gives participants a chance to see how the strategy works with typical classroom content. The third lesson is about dealing with a difficult customer, a topic that many in the room teach. The lecture video for this lesson is 10 minutes long and would have taken 30 to 40 minutes to deliver live. Once the video lecture is over, participants have a discussion about when the strategies presented in the lecture might be utilized. Each group role plays to demonstrate their understanding, and these role play lessons are recorded so the groups can reflect on their work. After the third lesson, we Skype with a corporate expert from Johnson & Johnson. Dr. Brandy Parker talks about her experiences using these flipped classroom strategies to increase efficiency, improve communication, and enhance training. She also answers questions that the participants have about how to navigate this type of change in a workplace. The final challenge is for each group to create a paper slide video that reteaches my presentation. I ask them to teach back to me what I have been attempting to teach them. This is the best way for me to know if they learned what I wanted them to learn. Groups create their paper slide lessons, practice by teaching each other, and then record and reflect on their final products. A flipped classroom is highly efficient and creates an active learning environment that each trainer can take back and use in their classroom tomorrow.